Welcome back uh, to the fish room and in today's video I'm going to be rescaping this uh, nano cube that I currently have in the fish room as a display aquarium and I'm going to turn it into a breeding for profit aquarium for the shrimps that I currently have inside and these are blue diamond shrimps. So the plan is to pull all the plants out together with the soil and the pots the bottom layer will remain as it is and I'm just going to add some uh, moss. That's all, so let's start working. In the background I added uh, two ceramic pads with moss and uh, the material of the ceramic pads is good for growing algae and biofilm and it will take a couple of weeks for the algae to develop also I will increase the brightness of the light I also added some botanicals in front uh, leaves and alder cones and uh, they will also develop a biofilm and it will be a food for the young shrimplets. The moss in the background will uh, take a couple of months to grow and develop so I know it looks uh, very bare now but uh, I will do an update probably in a month and we will see how fast the moss is growing. The egg 
hatching corner has expanded if you remember I added uh, the top row and a couple of days ago I added four more uh, small containers and I have uh, in total seven of them I've been getting more and more fry and I've been running out of space and uh, also you will see a black foam at the bottom I had to add it uh, to protect it from the heater that is located below the containers the water inside the containers was getting too hot it was 35 celsius and after adding the black foam the water stays in the range of 27 to 28 celsius today we'll have a look at the container with fry i finally got some gold white cloud uh, minnow fry i think there is 30 of them inside this uh, small container i have a 30 something gold white cloud minnow fry and they are approximately a week old i've been feeding them small powder food and slowly they are growing i'm just going to show you now the breeding aquarium that i set up for the adults a week ago i added uh, one male and two females to this small breeding aquarium and they spawned successfully so yesterday i decided uh, to do the same and uh, i got a lot of eggs below the false bottom as you can see they are very active i will try to catch the process of female releasing the eggs on the camera but it's not easy but anyway i will show the eggs below the false bottom and uh, after they finish uh, their breeding i will remove the parents the spawning mops the java moss also i will remove the false bottom and i will leave the eggs inside this aquarium This is exactly three weeks later and uh, I increased the light. It is set to 50% uh, brightness and the light is on for 12 hours. As you can see the left and the right side glass are completely covered in uh, green algae and uh, judging by the number of the small shrimplets that are still growing and increasing in size I would say they like it a lot and uh, also there's a lot of juveniles that are almost at the sellable size now the only thing that remains is to clean uh, the front glass so I can see what is uh, happening inside
I cleaned the front glass so at least now you can see what is happening inside the aquarium I also cleaned the glass feeding dish because uh, I will feed the shrimp soon and I want to check their colors and also I did the uh, water change because I didn't change the water in this aquarium for almost uh, three weeks let's have a closer look at the shrimps as you can see most of the small shimplets and juveniles have the same uh, colors as their parents deep blue color the bigger one you can see there a little bit to the left has a slightly lighter color of blue so as soon as they grow up to size probably when they are around three months I'm going to remove all the light blue color and I'm just going to leave the deep blue shrimps this is the growth of the moss in three weeks and in a couple of weeks time it's going to grow even more I didn't add any liquid fertilizers so it's growing uh, without any addition of anything extra the only thing it needs light and that's about it 